Police had trainer under investigation by the feds. Sources tell Fox 5 the Drug Enforcement Agency raided the team's practice facility last week. Wisdom has details on this. This coming on the heels of a win right. and more drama for the team. Yes, a story outside of the hmm. football story. Uh, neighbors tell Fox 5 that the DEA searched Ryan Vermillion's home on Friday. The Washington football team tells us that the head trainer is on leave due to a criminal investigation unrelated to the team. Now, Ron Rivera, the team's head coach, said, quote, I'm not going to comment beyond the statement we released. It is unclear what Vermillion is being investigated for, but during yesterday's press conference, Rivera was asked about players knowing that there was some type of investigation into the head trainer this past spring. Some players were talked to in the spring about this. I was just wondering, were there internal discussions about whether to allow him to continue working with the team going forward? After you discussions, uh, I, I have no idea what you're talking about as far as those things are concerned. This is Vermillion's second season with the team. He previously worked with the Carolina Panthers for several years with Ron Rivera. The two are known to be close friends. Now, we've learned that Vermillion did not travel with the team to Atlanta over the weekend. Rivera says doctors on the team will take over training and added he does not think that this will negatively impact the season. We reached out to the DEA. Who declined to comment about this? I've only lived in two other NFL markets. Mm -hmm. I don't recall anybody else having this much drama nonstop. You even get the win and you still have something yeah. going on behind Every, the scenes. 